Today I'm going to be opening uh, Broken Iris new CD. Or, well, not new CD, but a uh, collector edition. As you can see, Broken Iris on the top. Literally, I just got this in the middle of the day. Like as yesterday, I just got my uh, Front Row DVD thingy. Or DVDs. So let's see what's in this sucker. I don't want to use a knife too much because... If you don't know what Broken Arrows is, it's a good band. It's underground. So far you get what well, you can advertise. I don't like you see that's the box you get in. It's pretty cool, but the glue or tape kind of stuck to it, if you see right here. So, uh, that, not a big thing. But the box is pretty cool. You can find out how to open this. Oh, yeah, I believe it. Thank you. So that we get written in. Hmm. Well, I can't seem to have to get this open. I yeah, see like the hole right there and I have to open. saying Broken Irish would like to uh, sincerely thank all of those who have helped us on the way. The Verda family, the Nut family, the Colin family, the Kalk family, the Kerhoff family. I'd like to thank all of the artists who came to contribute audio, audio and visual elements to the project. Colin Egg Egger, Nathan Crandall, Rachel Verda, Verdi, Danny Koch, Steve Every, Alex Alexandra Athen, David Christian, and Chris Brolu, Broly, an extra special thank you to all the character voice, voices, Dee Parks, Joe, and Mary Cock, James Patrick, Verdi, and Sancher family, and your Molodon, Molodon family. We would also like to thank the Grand Design. Thank you to all fallen uh, fathers. I like to add them like that. I can't pronounce things. But the first thing you get when I open this up is a Broken Irish Tigger for I believe one of their CDs. I could be wrong with that, but yeah, that's what you get. And you get one of their stickers called Broken Irish. I got a new bumper, bumper sticker. And also, last week, you get your uh, six DVDs in order. I'm going to try to flip them around in a second. Get your six DVDs, or not DVDs, CDs, all audiobooks. And right here, you can't see your guitar pick, which they advertise. Look at that, It's a pretty standard guitar pick. I wouldn't recommend using it, but. That's cool. If you 
you take this out of the box, which that's what pulled the CDs, you get uh, something like this. This is a party, property of MMI warning. This cannot be the content on this data driver is granted at all three of them. This is pretty much a flash drive, which I believe comes with the uh, yeah music and with some other cool stuff. Yay, paper! I really got lazy doing this. Holy shit! You really got hit. It's a whole bunch of paper. There's my flash for this. Gotta dump all this out. I don't need this. That's a lot of paper. I don't like they did it. <laughs> and with this, you get a cool flash drive. Paper that. We're gonna have a flash drive. Don't know anything about it because it doesn't say how big it is, but pretty sturdy. I would recommend I would recommend buying this for fifty dollars. Hell yeah. So with all with fifty dollars you get two stickers. Six DVD or six CDs. One, two, do you have them labeled on like a number? I like see three, uh, four, five. It's kind of hard to see that one. And six. Give me your six DVDs and get this your back hand paper. A lot of paper. And. You do not get this max though. But you get this, which is in a box. So in the end, this is all what you get. I'm gonna spread everything out so y'all can see it from a view. Just trying to clean up a little more so I can see what you get. You get all this CDs, but the box, the gears that has the guitar pick. Yeah, for fifty dollars, it's worth getting. So I'd highly recommend buying it. Yeah, Rick and Brooke and I are have it. I'll take. I'll leave a comment in the description of uh, what I think of this. Audio. Peace out.